coming in as a young player, you know, breaking before a 60 yard game, you know, it's fun. You know, excited to get the fans that actually came out tonight and supported us. It was good. It was great. How big is the whole this whole game for your confidence? Uh, I feel like it's really big. You know, with us coming out performing the way we did, I feel like you know, that us as players, we come out with thinking we can play this offense. You know, we can come out and perform at that, that high level. So. How would you assess Will's performance? Uh, I feel like Will played a, a great game. He played a, a well-rounded game. He threw the ball well. You know, I, I think at one point in time he was perfect. Growing up here, you probably saw a lot of neutrino type offenses. What was your impression of what they were and now that you're in Now that I'm in uh, the coach of Trino's offense, I, I feel like we're going to play fast and we're going to get up and score a lot of points. You know, but watch his, his recent pass, you know, his, his pass, he put up a lot of points, so I feel like we're going to put up a lot of points. It seems like he tries to get you involved in different ways, you know, deep ball, early, reverses, short passes. You like getting involved in many different areas like that? Uh, yes, sir. I feel like Coach Petrino knows how to use his playmakers, you know, with me, Devontae, and all the other receivers, you know, and the other playbacks we have on my team. I feel like he knows what to do at, at the right time. How much is a guy like Devontae going to help you and Eli? You know, I mean, everybody's going to be focused on him and you guys. Yeah, mainly with, with Devontae being the, the, one of the best receivers in the country, you know, having him out there, it causes a double team you know, for, for the defense, you know, to keep his other receivers open in one on one situations. How is Will's ball different than Teddy's as a receiver? Um, I feel like Will, you know, he, he throws it a little harder, but, you know, they're both two different quarterbacks, so, you know, they're both great quarterbacks. You have to adjust to the new quarterback? Uh, not really, because, you know, I caught ball from Will last year as well, and, you know, Teddy at the same time. But catching the football is, is natural to the receivers. So you just come out and just leave the ball into your tub. I think we'll see more of you this year. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> was last year a challenge for you? Uh, I, I wouldn't say it was a challenge because, you know, I had someone that, that was a good player in front of me, you know, with, with Damian Copeland being there, you know. Watching what he done, you know, I could put some of his things, what he did last year, into my game this year. You like, uh, you know, it looks like you're going to get involved more in the special teams and returning to uh, I feel like it should be fun, you know, being back there returning to as well as kickoff returns. You know, just being out there, it's just fun for me. You just mentioned Damian. Can you talk about some of the things he, he taught you? Uh, Damian, to me, I feel like he was a technician. You know, he, he was he had great technique. You know, get, his get off was great. His stance was great. You know, I just wanted to to make sure that I could have good get off and, and good technique to kind of imitate his game and put a little bit of my game to it. Has Coach Petrino sat down with you much and talked about what he wants from you, what, he, what he's looking for for you? Uh, he, he just told me to go out there and make plays. You know, just go out there and have fun and make as many plays as you possibly can. What does it mean to you guys when you see you know, the likes of Mario Urea, Michael Bush, and Elvis Dumoulin coming back and watching you guys? Uh, it's exciting, you know, to have those guys, you know, guys that are in the NFL that know what they're doing to come back. You know, they get, you know, you can talk to those guys and get advice from those guys. So it's, it's, it's a good experience, you know, having the guys that, that are on the next level to help a young guy like us. Speaking of guys that have been at the next level, your position coach, Lamar Thomas, has been there. How has he helped you since, um, since the new stats are out? Uh, he's helped a lot, you know, he's a, a good guy, you know, he, he's always energetic, you know, he tells us one thing, just come out here and make it, you're going to come out here and make sure you love the game. And I feel like he loves the game, so he comes out here and gives, it, gives us 110% of the game. So you kind of have a different uh, approach to you guys, as Coach Dugan said, or how's, how's your uh, approach to you? Uh, more, more so with Coach Dugan, you know, he was more of a, a laid-back type of guy, but he coached, but you know, he was a great coach. And with Coach Lamar, he's a great coach as well, but he was, he's just more more into practice, more excited. Change what was it like just thinking back when you heard the coach of training you guys got out and now you, you know, just the better relationship with him and, and just the, how you thought that would affect you and you know about that again. Uh, when I heard Coach Trino was coming to his offense, I felt, you know, a sigh of relief at one point, you know, coming in on that he was going to throw the ball. As a receiver in Coach Trino's offense, you, you got to, you know, be ready to catch off a lot of balls. So that's what I was ready to do. That Trinity offense has you know, quite a bit of elements from his old offense. I mean, are some of the terms similar? Some of the plays similar? Uh, I wouldn't say the terms are similar, but the, more so the concepts. You know, we have different terms, but basically the same concepts that I did in high school. So it's kind of easy to learn for me, but at the same time, you know, I still got to stay on that. What have the coaches said as far as handling the next few weeks, the next few months, until uh, 
to fall through and stuff? Um, basically, they just told us that, you know, stay, stay healthy and, you know, stay in the weight room and stay strong and stay fit, you know, come out here so we, when we come back in the summer, we can perform.